<laughs> Welcome ladies and gentlemen, we're live in Long Island, in New York for Monday? Mm -hmm. You see how it would work better if this was Friday night? Yeah. Doing Friday night critical glitch sound nicer. Especially if it could be done glitch, we done crit chaos before we done glitch. Mm -hmm. So, Monday night glitch. Starting off with Taki Max and these two probably lost the quickest match oh, in the whole of WDW history last week. They versed the Texas Hitman. I think it was him. No, sorry, it's on the entire society. And they got destroyed. Mm hmm. Jay Lynn. Mm, Jay Lynn done mama. bits. Mm hmm. So they were like. Speaking of the Texas Hitman, I want to see him wrestle again because they are a good team. Mm. So they were like. Give us some new. Give us give us another chat next week, and this is the this is your defending. A new team. Just signed the other day. Disciples of Darkness. <laughs> yeah, what the hell's that? <laughs> There they are. Oh, uh, nah, man. Nah. I'm not. No, no. I'm leaving. <laughs> I am <laughs> not going to be in the same building as that as those two. I am not. Right. The, the one on the, on the, on the right. Uh, yeah, maybe. Maybe. That one looks a bit like Dunkel. I can understand that. But what the? what is that, man? Why is the flipping Yeti on the show? <laughs> it's a jacket. Why do we have Bigfoot on WDW, man? Him big ass with an ugly ass face. They I think, gonna I think try him. Nah, no. I, I feel think, like if I look at him, he'll try and take my soul from me. I think they are friends of Dunkle, but what else I've heard anyway. Oh nah, man. Dunkle has too many friends. <laughs> I've heard the friends of Dunkle's younger brother. Family. This guy has family. <laughs> I mean, mm -hmm. he does have a wife. It won't surprise me if soon Dunkle's kid pops up on the show as well. Mm, like, we've already seen that. And look at the crowd, man. That's scary. What are they doing? <laughs> to see, that's what they do. That's some food. That's Look at them. They're trying to make sure that they don't lose their soul. Tell me, I had the two, I had two, and kids, no, man. <laughs> oh, that guy in blue. They're still doing it. Nah, man. Oh, nah, man. They're gonna be if they. Nah, scary. they need to stop. That is actually scary. Oh. oh. <laughs> All right. So I don't know the names. Uh, Viking oh. and Bigfoot. Gold. Gold. Yeah. <laughs> Gold. Viking trying to go for the oh. person, and then we got Falcon Arrow by Devon Young going very quick over there. Okay. One. One. Two. Ooh. What, what, what is he? What is he doing? Is what? he like stretching or something? Oh! Oh! Yo, crazy ass nigga. <laughs> I'm, oh, um, I need to calm down. <laughs> crazy ass man. <laughs> That's what you meant to say. DDT by yeah. D1. Reverse by Viking. Invade DDT. I'm having one of those times where I'll just N word it up. <laughs> Everything. Oh, yo, 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 yo. Right, oh, whoa. Steve yo, Young. Yo, Steve yo. Young. Super kick. Super kick. Go for oh. cover. That was dumb, wasn't it? Hey, Get rid of go. the second opponent on your team. What are you doing? Oh, never. Oh, Doug God, Nibison. you missed a drop kick. Oh. Oh, belly to belly. Doug Nibison gets belly to belly. No, we got gold. Your gold is dark. <laughs> <laughs> And he goes across, oh. he hits him with one elbow, two elbow, oh. I mean two uppercuts, three uppercuts, four uppercuts, five uppercuts, seven. Neck breaker. Oh, I send around. Oi, oi. Why are you always in the way? Oi. Uppercuts. Uh, the uppercuts. And a drop, drop kick, kick and a cover. I never did one. <laughs> oh. 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 Oh, oh the neck oh, breaker. God. 
absolutely petrifying. My neck breaker. Oh, I'll neck break your neck. Another neck breaker. And the knee. The knee to do my young. Do my young reverses. Biking <laughs> with the super kick. Super kick. No, Mine will stare you in the face, you're not even noticing. What? I said you're staring him right in the face, he didn't even. Oh no. Oh no. Oh wow. god. Oh, oh god, look at the punches, my god. Oh! Oi! Line. Oi! I don't even know how many flips that work. Oh, look at oh, gold. Go With the yeah, splash! Go, the splash! The cover! cover. One! One two, two! Kick, kick out. out! Look at Viking thinking that it was over. I know. I like how Viking doesn't even have a name, it's just Viking. That's his name. Oh, the cutter! Oh! Oh no! Oh no! Neck, <laughs> neck breaker! Olaf! <laughs> the Viking! <laughs> oh god. This is not a nice sight. Oh, the, the cover! Cover! One! One two! two three! three. <laughs> wow. Get wrecked. And the team of Bigfoot <laughs> and Olaf. No, I thought Olaf debut. and Bigfoot were the same person. No! Vikings Olaf, because oh, he doesn't okay. have an actual name. Okay. His name is just Viking. That doesn't make sense. <laughs> Okay. Next match. Viking. Alright, and ignore the thing at the top. We are still on Long Island. And, um. Well, we continue once again with the Cyber. Cha Is it Cyber? Yeah, the mm -hmm. Cyber Championship Tournament. Round. Well, the semi finals now. So, round one and two of the semi finals. And uh, obviously, the can whoever wins that will base each other next week to see who is the number one contender for the Cyber Championship belt. And they will face the dual champion, Dunko Gott, who is going to have one heck of a night at the pay-per-view, having to defend not one, but two belts in one night. Mm. But I think he can do it, you know? I don't think so, bro. <laughs> No, but Two title can... defenses. Yeah. I mean, winning, won, but... winning a title and defending a title is one thing, but having to defend two titles is another thing, bro. Oh, yeah, true. Oh, it depends about who it's against as well, because, like, you got three like, big for guys. Example, let's, you, let's say Andre Silva wins the tournament. Right? Yeah. That's a big problem because Andre yeah. Silva is very, very good when it comes to submissions. Meaning mm -hmm. that since he is going to be facing him for the Cyber Championship first, then um, obviously it's going to be a lot harder for him to fight than fight whoever he's fighting in the World Championship mm -hmm. match. And uh, obviously yeah. there's been a lot of um, things going on between him and Jace, which. Who, kind of Silver? makes things. No, oh, no, Dunkle. no. Yeah, Dunkel and yeah, Jace, yeah, like, yeah. they've had a few exchanges of words, and, yo, know, things have gotten pretty bad. Mm. Like, I think it's. I think it's just expanded. It went from Jace and Dunkel to the Legion and the Villain Club. Mm hmm. No, we have to focus on this match to understand what we need. Let's get this match on the way. Raise the powerhouse. Andre Silva, the Brazilian submission machine. Brazilian. Or straight away, Rage is getting. He's getting it. Uh, Lifting uh, him up with a one handed power bomb. He goes for the cover. Already. That's it, referee. You can count to 100. Nope, you can't even count to 1 because there he is. Popping up. Rage trying to end him quickly. Getting the hits down. Right, you know, I have to say, I don't mind it because it goes a bit of a glitch and everything, but I think Rage really needs to change up his attire a bit. Mm. Maybe change his mask. I don't know. Oh! Could be the opening and just over needs. Yeah, it might be. Might be. 
Back it's suplex. Silver with a huge back suplex. Back black suplex. And there we go, Andre Silva with a clothesline. Now, what's the rage gonna do? Off the ropes. Up. Oh. Off the ropes and over, hanging on top. Oh! Enziguri! What's he gonna do? Oh, he's got no spin blood. Oh! The armbar! The armbar! The armbar is locked in! The armbar is locked in! I will never not like that transition. Oh, it's no. so nice. He fights out. I will. Oh, now Ray to the Boston Crab. Ray to the Boston Crab. Ray to the Boston Crab. Dope. Oh. 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 Oh mate. Oh Ray, yo, Ray should him back down from the challenge though. Going straight yeah. for a submission of his own. Oh, Ray for reversal. Oh Ray. Oh, oh, the shot. Oh! The referee was a bit like, you gotta get out of the way as well. Uh oh. Must have gonna go for Rage. Uh oh. Looking to oh. go for the. Oh, oh what? Yeah, what? Yeah, what? Yeah, what? Yeah, what? Yeah, what? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh! No way! No way! Oh my god! Mad! Oh! He has the advantage as well because he's taller and bigger. Oh, wow. Let's go to the next Rage match. Rage is going to the final next match. Oh. All right, ladies and gentlemen, and now we are in for a big one. I know, I know, I know. There is a lot of stuff going on here at Critical Glitch, but we, even you guys, all at home, and even the people in the backstage have to admit that currently Critical Glitch has be has it's currently being controlled by this rivalry. These two teams have single-handedly taken over Critical Glitch. First, it started, it started a lot with a little bit of back and forth, and uh, included that uh, included Tyson, and obviously Tyson leaving. It's kind of changed, like, Jesus, it's very, very bad right now. This rivalry between the Legion and um, the Villain Club point. has gotten very, very intense, so much so that the, the current champion got he even got attacked. And, uh... Obviously, his wife, uh, Angelina Wolf, did not like what she saw, and now she's also decided to take a challenge towards the villain club, trying to take on their women's competitor, Ashley Quinn, who had a fantastic match last week, and, well, she won it. Mm. And now, speak of the lady making her way into the ring. Accompanied by none other than Jace and Generico. Ashley hey. Quinn. Potential future women's champion. Mm. Then again, so is Angelina Wolf, a potential women's champion. Look at him. Is Jace smiling? <laughs> Probably this time. Is he cool. smiling? You know, it looks tight. like he's smiling. Now, I will say, how do you feel about Generico joining the villain club? Because you can't tell me you expected that. Nope, I didn't expect it. Like, Jace and Generico have so much history mm -hmm. that I never really thought that I would see them standing side by side with such frequency. Maybe it's just. You know, what's that saying? The friend of my friend is my enemy or something. No. <laughs> the oh. enemy of my enemy is my friend. Okay, never mind then. Maybe it's just... Maybe it's just yeah, because... No, that, makes, that does make sense. That does still make sense. 
Uh, Generico doesn't seem to really like Dunko that much, and we both know that Jace hates him. So yeah, the friend of my, the enemy of my enemy is my friend. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, and Gina Wolf into it towards as we clean into the corner. Get to the top row. Dunk, not Dunko. Dizzy knows what's going on. Dizzy Dunkle. just looks like he gets taller and taller every day. Stop feeding him. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Uh oh. Look how small Dunkel looks in comparison to Dizzy. Ashley Quinn. Ashley Quinn looking to fly. Go to the Oh my to the god. Face. Not even the chest to the face, man. And Whoa. again. Oh. oh. Yo. Yo, should be taking some tips from Jace. Jesus. If Yo, no remorse, up. man. Mm. Into the corner, taking her to the top rope. Go to the top rope. Oh, 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 she oh. Going for? oh, the spider oh, suplex. Oh, German suplex. Oh, sorry. Now she's going up top again. Oh, 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 the, oh the swanton swan Mrs. is Ashley. She rolls out though, and she gets the oh, backslide. Back, oh, me buster. Oh dear. Oh my, Angelina yeah, Wolf hasn't even, you know. Oh, oh, oh no. what's this? Oh no. Oh, she spins! Oh, and then she dabbed. What is she doing? Jace, you might want to tell her not to do that anymore. Mm-hmm. Oh, then that oh, definitely oh, wait. Oh, wait. Wait, what was she going for? Oh, whoa, 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 what's this? Oh, what's this? Oh, oh. Face Buster! Oh, oh the, the pin. pin! Oh! One! One two. two! Oh! What? That oh, was such a down. slow count! She didn't oh, even wow. kick Maybe out! Ref did. I swear that ref didn't, yeah, it didn't even look like he kicked out. It looks like Ooh. the ref just. Oh! Boy! The stare down! Oh, oh man. The oh. promos for these matches are gonna be so good. <laughs> Oh, the leg drop! Oh, yo, Generico! Oh, Gener Generico's about to do something booky. Oh, here we oh, go. Here we go. The close lines. And the, t the world power slam. Oh, she's feeling herself. Oh, Jace! Oh, now we know what, what Jace is like when it comes to his mouth. Sometimes he picks off more than he could bites off more than he could chew. But then again, that's why he's got his club, because once he bites off more than he can chew, they're right oh, there to reverse back him reversal. Up. And Ashley Quinn reversal. reversal and oh. no reversal to a clothesline. Oh, oh no. I'm oh, gonna walk. Uh oh. Uh oh lifting her up. Oh, this is uh, a move taken right out of Generico's bag. Uh oh. Black, Black mass. mass. Jeez. Look at look at Dunkle got supportive mm. husband. What guy? Slam on the face down and back up. Now she's gonna go for a super. Oh, oh not she's done. not done. The triple letter. I'm the three amigos. Look at dizzy. And a third. This guy looking guy. He actually looks kind of nice. Mm. He looks oh. like a little giant. Oh no. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Ashley Quinn! Ashley no. Quinn's in trouble! Oh, oh down she goes! Oh, what? What? Who? What? Chase! Who? Again! Maybe? Or Generico? Chase! It's Chase! He's having none of it! Oh, Angelina does not look happy. Going up top. Referee telling her to get down. I'll tell her to jump on her. Mm. Oh. Here we oh, go! Oh, reverse! Trap, miss. Moving out of the way! Uh-oh! Oh! oh I didn't know she had this! I didn't know she had this either! Kinshasa! Oh, Kinshasa! Oh, look at her! Oh, that looked, that looked like a bit of Shades of Jace as well. Mmm. Oh, oh, a core breaker! Throw that 
that from Tyson? The cover! Oh, she knows the elders. One! One two! two. No! Oh, what a kick out! Oh, I swear this ref is biased though. This ref count <laughs> is so slow. Oh, man. I don't Three. know, there's a lot of rumours. Yeah, I'm not sure about them, but some people came, are very keen on saying that Jace and Ashley Quinn have something going on behind the scenes. I can neither confirm or disconfirm that. Mm, I've, I've lost count of these other boys, you know. That's 10. The crowd says 10, so we're going with 10. Oh, All right. Look at Dunko trying to give some words of inspiration to his wife. Tell her to move out the way. Here comes Ashley Quinn. Oh, oh she's okay. waiting until she gets up again. What's she doing? She's waiting until she gets up. Ashley Quinn. Oh, oh Mystic. Oh, God, my God. Like misses. Angelina getting the hits in the back. And now she's going to rake her head oh, back. Oh, God. Slamming her head on the mat. Oh, my days. Match of the night so far. Mm, definitely. Oh, Here we go. Off the road. The knee and the off neck the road, breaker. The, knees, the neck breaker. Oh, oh no, she's setting up. If Jace gets involved again, I, feel, I think he's going to get ejected. Yeah. Here oh. we go. Let's see what in. Down she goes. Cover. One. One. Two. Two. No. Yes. <laughs> Keep it going! Muto! Keep it going! Keep it going! Keep it going! Oh! We want more! We want more! Oh! I think we want win. more! I think we Oh! Oh, it's trying to stop! Oh, Huge DDT! And the cover! Oh, the Whoa! Whoa! One! Two! No! I wonder if she covers anyone else like that. <laughs> <laughs> <You know what's laughs> <it>. <laughs> Going up the top rope. Top rope. Generico is doing nothing. Generico. I'm Look sorry. What, what is he doing? He's a hype man. <laughs> Can't really get him. Go! Oh! Oh! Gets oh! 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 She got caught. Off the top. Oh! Down oh, she goes. She's getting stomped out. <laughs> Generico is not even, he's not even in the, really on her side though, is he? He's on the wrong oh, side. Yeah, you got a point. Here we go. Oh, up, go up again, again, up again. What, what, what are we calling this then? This. What are we calling this then? I don't even know. Oh, the cover. One, two, and... Oh, no! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Fight forever! What are we calling it? Um, Fight forever! Oh! I'm reversed! Uh, I think we should call it something to do with Wolf. Um. Oh, oh my god! She's not it! She's too close! She's too that close. is gonna be so harsh! Ten Jesus! Oh, look at Dizzy, he's just disappointed. The cover! That's the surely cover. it! One! One. Two. Two! Oh my god! Oh my god! It's my reaction exactly! Uh oh. Oh, wait. Oh, here we go. The face buster again. Oh god. And the cover, oh. but we have to the ropes. One! One! Two! Two! Three! Oh. Excuse Where was the me? kick out? Where was Where the kick on out, earth ref? Was the kick out, ref? Now this ref, oh, oh the submission, wait, the submission, it's going for a submission victory. It's going She's for gonna tap. But the ref's, not even, tap. the ref's not even looking. She's oh, gonna yeah, tap. He is now. He is now. He's gonna tap out. He's gonna tap She's out. Gonna tap. She's not gonna, gonna tap. tap. She's not tapping. She's, She's not, not tapping. tapping out. This is oh. ridiculous. Oh. 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 Wow. 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 Oh my God. Oh. Yo! The cover! And the cover! One! One! Two! two. No. Kick out! I swear, we need to get another ref, man. This ref is trash. This ref is bookie. Left in a row. Oh no! We're calling it the blue... Oh! 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 Oh!
Oh, oh Bradley! DDT! That's, I swear that's her move. Oh, never mind. Oh, what? Reverse! Yeah, Flipped over his shoulder! Oh, what's this? Uh-oh. Oh, did oh he, um... God. Oh, Dizzy can't even watch this. Look at him. Oh, close line. Back up to her feet again. Oh, she's in, she in, in. She's right near the, the ropes. She's right near the ropes. Oh yes. Uh, I'm not even sure if she touched the ro the ropes with the booky ass referee. <laughs> oh, the best. Reversed by Angelina. Reversed by oh, Ashley. Oh, reversed by Ashley Quinn. Into the corner she goes, or not? Oh! Jeez! Oh! 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 Jericho, help her up, get her up! Isn't it? What are you doing? Why is he staring at? Why is he staring down Angelina Wolf? Maybe he's gonna do it. Maybe it's a massive plot twist. Maybe he's gonna. <laughs> <laughs> what? Angelina Wolf is gonna. Oh. Nope. Okay, never mind. And then you know we'll start gonna pray. Jesus. Oh, oh lifting her up. He's lifting her up. He's turning her around. Turn her around. Oh, 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 oh my god, what? Whoa. Whoa. Oh, what? That was Jesus. so nice. I know. <laughs> oh, the Quinn. They swap places now, yeah. Is that how it is, Generico? Oh, because Generico's not been in, not done anything yet, so he can't get ejected. Uh, uh, yeah. Oh, neck breaker. Oh, there he is. There he's he is. Doing the yeah. he's, he's doing the same thing that he oh, did before. Oh, what's this? He's for a swing. Oh, is he gonna oh, bring her around town? He's gonna bring her around town. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Two. Three. Four. <laughs> Five, Five, six, six seven. Seven is the lucky number. Go for and the, the pin win. And the cover. Over. Referee Jesus, man. One, Show some hustle. Two, three. And Ashley the villain club and Ashley Quinn are successful. What, what a match. match. This referee showed no hustle. Isn't it? Isn't it spooky, man? Trash, GLD. Come Best on, man. Best match on WDW as a whole. Mm hmm to date, to date. Oh, look at her. Look at her pointing at Dunkel. What a match. Wow. Fam, the villain club. They are really true, re well and truly a force to be reckoned with. Mm-hmm. Well, we've seen Ashley Quinn get involved, but, you know, we still got to see what the the car do as well. They won matches as well. Mm, that's true, that's true. Anyway, let's get into the next match. Now time for Benjamin Carr to have his match against the one and only Mac. Well, so here comes his manager of the moment, Vince McMahon, coming down to the ring. Oh, well, oh my God! God there's Omega, the man who Vince McMahon screwed out of a match. Mm. D oh, the DDT. D D D he's not done. Omega's not done. Oh, oh, oh! oh. Ali Facebuster. Face oh, he's not done. Oh. Oh, taking oh. him around town a bit. Oh. The drop kick. The Whoa, what drop kick? Oh, he's not done. I'm like, he's not done. Oh! Jeez. To the chest. Okay, what's he going for now? Oh. Oh. Right, send him back into that corner. 
Norris seems to uh, be dragging Mr. McMahon. Send him into the, into the wall again. And again. He yeah, likes walls, doesn't he? I'm and he sends him through the door. Room. He's sending him over to oh. that corner over there. Vince McMahon's head smacking off the damn, the damn thing over there. And here we go. Omega now taking Vince McMahon to the table. What's he going to do? Omega, what you going to do? Uh -oh. Omega oh, lifting oh, up the Dave's Buster. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That, that thing. Yeah, that thing. <laughs> Let's go straight into the match, you know. Right, and now let's get back into the Cyber Champion, the Cyber Champion, yeah, Cyber yep. Championship tournament, round two of the semi-finals. And as we just saw, obviously, my man just got his boss just got attacked, so Mac will be coming to the ring by himself. Obviously, we this time we've um, been smart well, after what we saw um, last Friday. Oh, wait, hang on. If this is money, we can get that doesn't make any sense. Because if this is week three, mm -hmm. and then we got week four of. This is my point. Anyway, as I was saying, um, yeah. Oh yeah. We, after what we saw last Friday on Chaos, with the two horrific injuries of um, well, oh, yeah. the injury of Aiden, and then obviously the uh, alcohol of blood that we saw from Jason Clinton. This time we do have the medical staff on site a lot quicker and very like openly, readily available. So this mm. man will be just fine. I mean, yeah. he, had to be good. Well, he, he, should, he should have gone. Um, you know, like he should have been my boot, or I should he. he, he, he Held back too much, I think. Mm, true. There we have it. Mac! It's, it's nap, nap time. time. Snap time. Snap time or tap, tap time. time. Pick one. Wife Benji picks all three, but doesn't to you. What if he. I oh mean, my god. I still think that the winner of this is going to be Rage. After his match. Oh my it's god, mate. So oh. good. That was so good. completely unexpected. Exactly. He's on a roll. After mm. a bit of a crappy start to the tournament in this match. Played oh, yeah, end. yeah. I think Benjamin's going to win this. He's like unexpected. Like last week, he was like pretty much bound to lose. And he came out of nowhere Ooh. and won. So I'm, I'm putting up Benjamin. I'm putting up Rage. Oh, I mean, in, in this finals. match, not in. Oh, oh my god. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh. The Ghanaian superstar looking to make his dad proud. His father, Angelo, general manager of the other show, and his sister. It's weird that he didn't draft any of his kids. <laughs> I know. Oh. Jeez. I mean, it's oh. not weird, but still. It's a bit like mm. a bit booky in it. Like. I mean, yeah, probably it's because he yeah. did book him to try and put him in all the matches. Yeah. Put all the belts on Benjamin. Mm hmm. Including the oh. women's belt. Gladiatoria Championship. Benjamin, Ch uh, Benjamin Carter, the Gladiatoria Champion. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Benjamin off the ropes. Oh. Jesus, Benjamin's on fire. Ah. Uh. Oh, look oh, at this military the press! The Ghanaian press! Oh my gosh! The Ghanaian press! What the heck happened to Mark, huh? Oh, no, Vince McMahon. Nope. Win. 
There we mm. go. Oh, Benjamin gets reversed. Oh. And what the hell are you doing? What are you doing? Yo, you know, what happened to the new Kings, man? I know, right? The first like, match was good. And what's up with the like, this catching division falling apart? Yeah, well, it's not for this talent. Yeah, but and there isn't, like... It, the thing, there's, like, loads of talent, but it's not the same talent that there was at the start. Like, we've... The, the teams that are currently carrying the tag division, bar the Legion and Villain Club, are the new attack teams. I want... I just want to know, what the hell happened to the tag team that we saw right at the start? Because the New Kings and the Undead, they were both such good tag teams. Mm. Like, their leaders were strong. Ace was the first champion. Now look at Ace. Chilling out, looking like Gary Barlow. No like, to be seen. Uh, yeah, we've not even seen Ace in a while, man. Obviously, and we saw his boys. They had a match, but I don't got, think they won it. You've got the new ones. You've got oh, not new, new, but you know, you've got oh, you've got um, the M MSP, and you've got um, S Ch S Strong Style Society. That, no, no, Shrunk's like, outside, they have done pretty well. The MSP could use a hand. DOD seem like a good tag team, and the Texas hit and they're great. Yeah, the Texas hit My only question great. is, what the hell happened to the new Kings? Mm. We're talking about a team where Dre was leading the charge. This man here was probably one of the most unstoppable forces in the whole of the show, mm -hmm. and Ace was one of the smartest wrestlers we've ever seen, whereas Mella. Although she didn't wrestle much, she was just a great asset to have around. And then mm. you had, obviously, um, oh god, Ale Alex Bennett. Mm -hmm. Well, obviously she's doing fine for herself, but she's left. Mm. And then Dre seems to have lost all this confidence in himself. Mm. Ace and Ace and Jay themselves have not been seen in a very long time. Mm -hmm. Max seems to have just fallen off, and Mella. I don't Mel even know, man. She just didn't even seem to pick up. Like, we were like, really yeah. expecting Mella to pick up, to, like, step into the shoes once Alex Bennett was gone, but what happened? No idea, man. It's sad. It's actually sad to see, because they were one of the teams that, like, they were up top, but always, man. Mm. And now it's sad to see, like, oh. them struggling. I'm kind of locked in, yeah. I'm not going to tap out. Is Matt gonna tap out? Oh, he's struggling. Yep, he's tapped he out. Has. Wow. Man. This Mark, is sad. Mark, Mark, you disappointed me, man. You actually did. Well, now we have our two finalists, the Ghanaian superstar and uh, sorry, the Ghanaian gold medalist and finally Rage. Getting his shot. Week. What match that's gonna be? Let's get into the next match. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to yet another match, another clash, another battle. Now, while T um, deals with technical difficulties, also known as Younger Cousins, I will be taking over the, ref the uh, commentary position for this match. He did it last week, I did it this week, so I think it's pretty fair. Alright, so anyway, making her way down to the ring, we have Kaiva, and that's the Japanese bulldozer. Made her debut last week, absolutely fantastic, brilliant. I mean, I've got not, I've not got much else to say about uh, her. Oh, yeah, she's a really good. She's oh, I know she's a great wrestler, and uh, that's. I mean, that's all we really care about on this show. If you're a great wrestler and if you're a great talker, you're gonna do great, uh, great things. And if you're a great wrestler but not a great talker, you'll probably still do great things. Just don't let your fist do the talk. Just let your fist do the talking for you. Now making her debut here in WDW. Sandra Piper. I believe Sandra Piper is currently WIW's um, women's champion. If I'm correct. 
I am not 100% sure, so I can't confirm. This uh, confirm, no, just confirm. I'd have to recheck that. But as of right now, I do think that she is the uh, main champion. All right, come on, don't take. All right, you're not gonna take it. Let's go. Jeez, come on, woman. <laughs> And now she's finally at the ring posts. Meaning she might actually get him a ring. Finally, <laughs> making her way to the ring. And now their opponents. Most likely, well, a potential future world women, uh, win, uh, a potential future diamond champion and the current diamond champion. Here we have it, the current diamond champion, Medusa, bringing her ring, a ring, bringing it down to the ring again. Getting set for her matchup. Very nice. But will we be saying seeing this belt around uh, someone else's waist come uh bad, bad blood, I wanna say? Crap. <laughs> come war zone, maybe? Well, come to the next pay-per-view. I can't remember what it's called. Anyway, making her way down to the ring. As I just said, a potential future Diamond Champion in the flesh. The unbeaten so far, Alice Blackwell. Sister to a Kane Blackwell who is on Chaos, but obviously we've, uh, we all know. Yeah. All right, so her making her way to the ring. Now she is a, right, so for me and uh, obviously for T. Alice is currently most likely the best women's competitor on either, well, one of the best women's competitor on either brand. She's just so fast and strong and everything. Like she's very, very, she's a very good wrestler overall. and. I think that she would make a fantastic diamond champion. Not that I have any issues with the current diamond champion, but I feel like Alice might suit the role better slightly. Anyway, let's get the show on the roll. Tornado tags, you know how it is, because we don't play normal tags. And straight away, Kaiva trying to go for the uh, for Alice Blackwell. Oh god, Kaiva going for the champion. Sandra Piper gonna go for Oh, this could be a good match. Sandra Oh my god, power driver! Here becomes Kaiva with a massive axe handle. And now Sandra Piper on the ropes as she tries to go for Alice Blackwell, but she gets out of it. No issues. Too easy. And now the champ doing a reversal. Now she's going to try and lifts her up with massive back suplex. Beautiful. Beautiful. And here we go. Alice Blackwell taking a bit of her, taking her time, going up top rope for a second. What's she going to go for? Here we go. The champion. Oh, my God. And Alice Blackwell trying to go for a moon stomp, but it misses. And now it was going to go. Sandra Piper trying to do something, but she gets caught out. A reverse on the champion taking Kaiva against the commentary table. And here we go, sending it back into the ring. Oh, Alice Blackwell with a disrespectful look, tap to the face as well. And there we go! She connects, and there we go, a moonsault, standing moonsault, and the champion 
and Alex Black were both bringing their women to their feet. And then Sandra Piper with a quick reversal. Kaiva not so lucky. Sandra Piper reversed by Alex Blackwell. Alex Blackwell. Kaiva goes up and she reverses the champ. And now Alex Blackwell connects with the maneuver. And here we go. It looks like the champ, the champ could be in trouble. And Kaiva slams off the ropes. And now Kaiva lifting up her end. Alice Blackwell lifting her up for the uh, black snap. And then we all oh, deadlift German suplex. Beautiful. And now there we go. Alice Blackwell going for a pin. And then we gets broken up. The dark snap is what that's called. And here we go. Kaiva lifting her up for the sub. No, wait. That ain't no Simone drop. Here we go. Um, Kaiva holding the champ in the middle. So let's go. What's she going to go for now? She's lifting her. Oh my god. Be what the hell? That's strength. Here we go. And the champ getting caught by Kaiva. This could be a problem. Kaiva with the. Oh no. Face slap. Uh, face buster, I believe. Oh, and the champ is in trouble. Kaiva goes for the pin. Here we go. Alice Blackwell in trouble. Oh, and a kick out. Thought it was over. Here we go. And again. Three headbutts to satisfy Sandra Piper. Could Sandra have Alice Blackwell's number? Obviously, we've seen that the women's division has been getting ever more just strong. Not so. A chaos is, is a, a little bit weaker, but I mean, the the women on this brand, I mean, to name a few, you've got Medusa, you've got Alice Blackwell, Sandra Piper, Kaiva, you've got Alice, uh, you've got Angelina Wolf, you've got, oh my, you've got, um, uh, what's, uh, you got Ashley Quinn as well. Those six women, six horse women right there, that's what I'm going to call them. Absolutely tantalizing to watch. And then, obviously, you've got more women on the roster, like Mella who is, uh, despite not being doing so well so far, she could definitely kick it up a notch or two. We've got the girls, Yasmina and Mercedes, who again, they could kick it up a notch or two. Alice Blackwell getting the spins. And here we go, the champ looking to end it. And will she end it? Obviously, I'm just paying it. Oh. What's going on? Oh, wait, hold the phone. That champion minute. Oh, my God. Jesus. Alice Blackwell, what the hell just happened? Oh, and there we go. She's climbing up on top a bit sexual. Hell no. Nah. So, oh, man. Here we go. Kaiva trying to go for a pin broken up before the pin can even get put in. Now we go, Alice Blackwell carrying the beast. Here we go off the ropes. And the three head the three headbutts now. Knocking down the champ. Alice Blackwell choking out Kaiva. One, two, oh no, three. Oh no. Oh no. I mean, technically speaking. She didn't get pinned, but oh, what? A, oh, it's a shame. That match could have gone on a bit longer in my books. Could have gone in a bit longer. But here you have your winners, Sandra and Kaiva. Sandra making her debut, and Kaiva, well, making her second appearance, now adding a win to her roster. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to. Well, I wouldn't call. I'm not sure if this was what you would call a match because it is Generico joined the Villain Club last week and decided on his own terms that he wants to face the the leader of the Villain Club. He wants to face the TV champion Jace. Now this wasn't G.O.D.'s idea, so. But he's been getting a lot of stick for it, saying that he doesn't know how to control his show, saying his show's uh, unorganized, comparing him to Angelo. Um, I mean, none of this is none of, none of this is his fault. So the the whole Legion and villain clipping is not his fault. Um, the whole you know um, Holy Alliance getting attacked that wasn't his fault. Um, 
Well, I suppose. Oh, the um, the Mac, um, the Mac Vince McMahon thing that wasn't his fault. It's a bit bad as well because he's currently. I mean, I mean, unless he gets to change his contract under his contract, he says that he's not allowed to use his own physical force to mm. impose justice or to sort things out. So he's kind of got his arms tied behind his back because he's not really allowed to hit anyone or. Mm -hmm. anything you can really all you can really do is put out suspensions with what's the point when if you put out suspension on one guy another guy's going to do the exact same thing that that guy did and if you continue suspending everyone then you're not going to have a roster mm. so it's a bit messy anyway his opponent for tonight obviously we've already mentioned him love him or hate him it is in fact the TV champion Jace making his way down to the ring all right, he's uh, picking he's, up the. Oh, what? Oh, he dropped his belt there. Was it? Was it? <laughs> it was <a> <laughs> yeah, you don't bring your belt, then you're not gonna. Def you're not gonna defend anything. Someone else is gonna come out and take it. All right, so Generico, the referee, making his way into the ring as well. Oh, Jace does not look happy, making his way down to the ring. Generico backing away. Chase dropping the belt is about to go down. Chase leaves the, leaves the ring. He oh. said it's over. It's, it's over. over. He's, he's, it's over. He's done with it. He's done with the belt. Ladies and gentlemen, Generico is your new television. Champion! Oh my god! Oh my! What the hell did I just see? What? What is got? I'm so confused. What? There it is again. In place. I'm okay. Generico. Generico is your new TV champion. What the? F what? And oh my god, you. ladies and gentlemen. Oh, he's saying if you want it, come and get it. Ah. Uh. Apparently, Sarah Jordan's coming down saying, yeah, I guess he's got something to say. You have to give him some ears. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Siler Jordan, and quite frankly, I am pissed off. And I am disgusted by what went down between Jace and his buddy Generico. You know, Jace, last week I wanted to give you an opportunity to take me on one-on-one. -on -one, an opportunity to have the best match of your career. But instead I don't get one-on-one, -on -one. no, I get four-on-one. -on -one. And that might be the way your mom likes it. But that's not what these people deserve to see. No, they deserve to see the television champion step up to the plate and take on the natural born thriller. But that's not what they got. They got outside interference. They got you playing games. And then now you're playing the biggest game I've ever seen. You're handing over a title. You're handing over the TV title. You might as well have thrown it in the garbage and set it on fire. That's what I see you doing. And Generico, what the hell? Why would you take a title like that? Why would you let someone hand you a title? It meant nothing. You are not a champion. You're nothing now. And you've made that title worth nothing. But that's okay because I'm gonna take back that title for these fans and for myself and to save this company from what you two did. You know, Jace, obviously you were raised by a horrible mother who likes it four on one. And you were told that somehow the way you behaved was appropriate. The way you behaved was the way a professional handles themselves. And you were wrong. And your mom was wrong. And Generico, I don't know your mom. She might not like it four on one like Jason's mom does. But the fact is, she didn't raise you right either. But now I'm going to get the opportunity to take you out to the woodshed. I'm going to take you out, Generico. I'm going to whoop your ass. I'm going to teach you what it's like to be a real champion, what it's like to be a real man. And I'm going to take that title from you because you do not deserve it. I'm going to take that title, I'm going to raise it up, I'm going to raise this company up to a place it's never been. And you know what? 
when I'm done with you, Generico. I hope the shame gets you to leave or get you to step up. Because honestly, right now, you're a disgrace. And this is going to kick off this man right here, the former TV champion. Jesus, I like that only after him losing his belt do I actually start calling the belt the proper name. <laughs> but, um... <laughs> Former TV champion Jace making his way down to the ring, and he has he has already said that he's doing this on purpose because he wants to have a few words with the current dual cyber and world champion Dunkle God. He said he has some words to say to him. He has some words to say to the man because well we all know that they've got a lot of beef going on. Mm. It's rather happy if my manager's lost his belt. Alright. So let's see if Dunkel will be here to reply. Jay's waiting. They're waiting. Ah, oh, here we go. There we go. Of course, very well expected that this man right here. Oh, look at it! Look, the title looks beautiful. Mm. But you know, this could be one of the last times we're seeing this title on him. Mm. It's potentially a matter of time until it might be on the waist, on the around the waist of someone else. So, Fatality. let's mm. <laughs> we we'll get too used to it, I guess. But obviously, making his way down to the ring, of course. Dunkel never backs down from a fight, never backs down from anything, really. Mm. And I'm mm. pretty sure like, he's got a few words to say to Jace as well after, well, he claims that Jace has disrespected him, disrespected his family, and disrespected a lot of things, disrespected mm. his gods, his elders. Mm. Nah. Something that he's definitely not gonna wanna let slide. Duncan looking slightly different. Mm -hmm. I believe he dyed his beard. Because <laughs> uh, I don't care, but he dyed his beard and made the face paint. Yeah. Or maybe he didn't. Maybe he didn't. Maybe maybe this whole time he's not even lying and he is a god and he's just drank from the fountain of youth. Oh, that's a good fucking good. Yeah. Because he is looking a lot younger. Because Duncan, we saw last week get attacked by Generico. Mm. Well, here he is, the Universal Honor Champion, Dunkel, Dunkel, Dunkel. So I hear you go announcing that this, the Legion is the uh, best stable here on uh, WDW here on on Crystal Glitch. However, the matter of fact is the real truth is that the villain club could take on Odin himself. Do not dare soil your mouth with the speak of my elder. Odin would destroy you with a blink of his eye. You are not worthy of the gods, but they have sent me here to lay claim. Watch your mouth, Jace, or the wrath of the gods will come down upon you through me. Why do you speak as if I fear you? You think your awe-inspiring god sent you down here to bring their wrath? Don't disrespect your elders! By saying that they sent such a weak debt collector to end me of all people. I fear no man, entity, or any wannabe hero, Dunkle. Bank on it. Jace, Jace, Jace. <laughs> you make me laugh. Since coming here, I have been portrayed as a patron of justice. Yeah, it was well. I ran with it for as long as recently. But I am no hero. And I definitely could care less about justice. Indeed, it has brought me not one, but two championships. But this, <laughs> oh, this is just the beginning. I will rule this place overall, and you, Jace, will be the first example of my total domination. You and your feeble villain club will burn under me and my legion. We will destroy all who dare to face us. 
We are legion. We are immortal. And I am king. The gods guide me and spit upon you, Jace. I spit on you. I spit on your little backup dancers and I spit on your gods. I spit on everything. If you are a god and I'm Kratos, if you're a legend and I am the legend killer himself, if you're immortal then I am the apple from the garden that will bring you to mortality and swift execution. In my world now, Vanko, and nobody, I repeat, nobody dictates this world but me. Yes, it's such a shame. You think you are the first to try and pose a threat against us? Many have tried and all did they fail. We have slaughtered the competition to become what we are. We have made many sacrifices to the gods. Just wait, Jace, villain club. Things have been fair thus far, but we are done playing around. Now we conquer one sacrifice at a time, one title at a time. We will see you all in the ring. Don't go. I am not a threat. I am the foreshadowing of things to come. You think you can... You think you are the only one that can turn up the heat? I will dismember all of you one by one. You think that these trinkets mean a thing to me? Do you not just see what I did with that crappy little title? The titles that you want to get one by one? You see, that's your problem, don't go. That is your problem. That's all you think about. The gold, the little toys. I couldn't give two craps about those little toys. That's not what I want. What I want is to bring you down. I want to destroy you. I want to dismember all of you one by one. Let's not be childish. Call me the peasant because it's time for revolution and it's time for your kingdom to burn down. And don't worry. I'll have that little angel snort your ashes so you can get your rocks off one last time. I know that's what you're into. I no longer have anything left to say towards you or your peasant. In the end, I at least hope you all put up a great fight worthy for you all to have safe passage into Valhalla. Keep rotting your mouth, Jace. You'll regret what's to come. The villain cup's blood will be on your hands. Here's the thing, I don't see a thing that I cannot back up in the ring, backstage, outside, in the sky, anywhere. My club knows what battle they picked. We fear no man or god. The only blood being spilled will be your own. Don't forget, Dunkel, you started this war a long time ago, champ. You didn't need to, but you did. It was your choice. Now you will face the consequences. At bad blood, I will destroy you. I will beat you down. I will tear you limb from limb and make sure that your organs are preserved. Your head will be put in a tank and it will be put in my bedroom so you can see me every single night after I've destroyed you. And then I will take that little trinket of yours and put it to some good use, finally.